In this video I'm going to show you how you can add an average line to your charts. Adding an average line is a great way to provide more context to your charts as it will quickly and easily show how each individual result relates to the overall average. In this sample table, I have the sales by city of a fictional retailer. In the first column, I have the city names and in the second, I have the corresponding sales for each city. To the right is the column or bar chart that shows the sales by city. My goal is to add a horizontal line to the chart that will show the average sales of all the cities. This would be very helpful as I could quickly see which cities are performing well and which ones are underperforming. First, I'll need to determine the average sales for all the cities. I'm going to add another column to my data table called Average. Next, I'll calculate the average sales for all the cities in cell C4. The formula would be equals average followed by an opening bracket. I'll now highlight the range of sales results. Then, I'll click on the F4 button to make the range an absolute reference. Finally, I'll add a closing bracket and click enter. I will now copy the formula to the remaining rows. To add the average values to the chart, I can highlight the values and copy them using Ctrl plus C. Now, I'll highlight the chart by clicking on the edge. I can paste the values into the chart by using Ctrl plus V. The average value has now been added to each city as a second column. However, we wanted to have an average line on our chart. To fix this, I'll click on one of the average values. You can see that all of them are now selected. I'll right click one of them and get a list of options. I will select Change Series Chart Type, which will open a dialog box. We can see that both Sales and Average are clustered column charts. I'll click on the drop down menu for the Average series and select Line, and then click OK. There we have it. We now have an average line showing on our chart. We can even customize the line. I'll right click on the line and change the line type to a dotted line and then make the fill or color gray. As you can see, it's easy to add an average line. It also makes it much faster to quickly look at the chart and easily identify the cities that are doing well and those that are struggling. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe.